here we are we're at the front page of the sites up here at the top you'll see you can go back to home where we're at now you got the about us page you can contact us here you can go to your account I'll, I'll knock that out here go to your account so I'm gonna go ahead and sign in Should be right. <laughs> the door will allow box break. There we go. All right, well, we're signed in here, and uh, you'll see under my account all your options. We'll go over that here in just a minute. Let's get back to the live page. Uh, you have your cart. This is where you'll go. You'll see I added a couple teams here. Uh, you'll see your cart here. We'll go over that as well. Uh, down below, you'll see the pick a pack categories. You go here, all the, this is all the personal pick a packs. You can pick a pack here uh, for uh, opening there in our first hour. We got pick a teams, all the pick a teams for that night where you pick your own team. We have randoms. This will usually get you one or two spots in the breaks. So there you go. Uh, we got our fantasy leagues. We run NFL and baseball and NBA leagues. Right now, we're currently running the NBA league. But um, we'll have MLB starting up here again soon once uh, baseball's about to start. We have our supplies page. And then let's go ahead and go back home. You can click that there. Uh, also, we have this link here. This will show our schedule and our rules. What is a box break? Explain to pick a pack, teams, randoms, base cards. How do you find your break? All that good stuff. Additional rules, how we handle the breaks, and all that good stuff. We'll also have the tutorials and everything linked in there here shortly once we're done. Also, we have our slideshow here. We have a rewards program. Uh, every month, we have a free three box break for our top uh, breakers of the month. The top 20 breakers will always uh, get in the free break, and then we'll have uh, some spots random off for that night you also on all orders you'll get five percent back so every time you pick up a spot you'll earn reward points and uh here's our reward points page it tells you how it works how many points you get all that good stuff all right and let's see here once that changes we'll go back uh right here we have our next slide break this will show you when our next slide break is uh, I need to actually edit that, but um, this is what this will be our daily news here. You always want to check here every day or when you get on the site. This is where you'll have all the information for that night. Like right now, we're going to have the teams reloaded uh, tonight, so we'll have more teams, fresh pick of teams up tonight. Right here, you also have specials or maybe news on uh, new breaks, stuff like that. And also down here, we'll also have news as well. So this is your two news areas that you want to check. Um, and here's some more of the slides. So here we got check out our past hits. You can click here and check out a lot of our new uh, nice pulls, big pulls here from uh, all the breaks on the site. Got lots of stuff to go through. A bunch of RG, uh, RG3s that we loaded up recently from picks. But uh, lots of cool stuff to look through. A bunch of big hits. But uh, this will be updated once or twice a week with uh, the recent hits let's go ahead and go back here down below here this is a very important spot you can view your past breaks and you'll see I'm live right now with a tutorial but if you go down here you'll see all the past events they are all dated with the date so you can go back and find your breaks or watch lots of uh, boxes broken you can go back and see all kinds of breaks here from the past months so there it is that's how you find your the past breaks usually the next day after we break you'll see last night's breaks are still here on the front page so you can go through those as well if you're in breaks last night right here is our featured products this will have all of our uh, featured stuff 
for the current night here. Let me go ahead and take that off. All right, and there's this right here is our live. Uh, this is where we'll be live at night, right here inside this event page. You'll see this was last night, so we're not live. But when we are live, this video will be the live feed right here at the top. Right here will be a chat. This will pop down, and this will be a chat box for everybody uh, to chat during the live breaks. And we'll go down here to the bottom. We got all our different links about us. Contact us, our eBay auctions. And we'll go ahead and click that out, show you eBay auctions. Right here is where you can bid on different breaks. All our auctions sold out last night, uh, so we don't really have anything up right now. But um, we every week we have three, four days worth of auctions you can look through. So you can always go down here, use this link, and go right to eBay and uh, bid on box breaks. All right, also... We have a couple little category index, stuff like that. You can go in here, see all the different categories on the site. Instead of using this menu, you could use this one if you like. Uh, our nice pool section, we already showed that from the slideshow. And uh, down here, we have, this is a very important part of the site. This is our PM option. When we're offline, you can send us an email. This is the best way to contact us. So you can put in your, make sure to put in your email and your name so we know uh, who's uh, writing us and then send your message. And uh, when we're online during break nights, you can click here and uh, talk to us. I'll go ahead and show you that. Let me go ahead and I'll open up PM real quick. There we go. All right, PM is open. And you'll see that we're online. So then you can you can click that. And then there we go. That's me on both sides. <laughs> but uh, we chat, you can chat here if you need help finding a break or anything like that, have any questions, just uh, send us a PM while we're live. There you go. All right, that's the front page. Now we're going to go ahead and go through all the different options, uh, how to check out, all that good stuff. For Pick a Pack, we're going to go ahead and go here. We have all the different sports here for packs. So if you just like NBA, you can go ahead and break that down. Here's our NBA packs that are live right now. Let's say we want to go into SP Authentic. You want to look right here. It says there's one hit left. We keep up with the hits live here. And you can see here the blasters, possible hits. You never know. Skybox, the same way, possible hits. But um, there's Elite Basketball, three hits left. Retro with two. And you'll see Pinnacle Basketball, there's three hits left. So let's go ahead and go into Pinnacle Basketball. You'll see right here, if you go down, you'll see the description. There's two autos, one memorabilia per box. All that good stuff, a breakdown. Right here, you'll see the price, $18 per pack. And you can click here, you'll see these are the numbers of the packs. There's 10 packs per box, so you'll see there's 9 packs left. No hits have been pulled yet since there's 3 hits left. So uh, let's say you like pack number 3, you can grab that. Add it to cart, and you'll see right there, your cart is below on the edge. So you'll see, okay, there it is. Maybe I want pack seven. Let me go ahead and add that. Scroll down, there it is, three and seven in your cart. All right, and you can use this to navigate back here. All right, let's go ahead and go to pick a team. Actually add it in. Let's see here. I'm gonna go to my car. I'm gonna show you guys teams real quick. Let me take that out of stock. Take that out of my cart. Go back to pick a team. Since everything's sold out, I just put a couple in here on Absolute. Here's Absolute pick a team. You'll see here the description. Click here and you'll see the teams here in the list and how much each team is. $4 for the Cardinals and Falcons. Say we want the Cardinals, we'll add them to our cart. And there they are, right there. All right. Let's go to our randoms. Same deal. You got the sports broken down. 
Here's each random break. We got the pass time break number three, which is very important because that's how you're going to find your random break. You'll see you'll get one spot for nine bucks. There's 20 left in stock. So we can go here and uh, you can see the description. Also, what cards go out. Some of the uh, products have tabs here. They may have a checklist, what cards go out, all that good stuff. But uh, you'll see here, you can add four quantity and add to cart. And there it is. Four quantity there. We can also move this a little bit if you want to see. Uh, that's how you add randoms. You can also ran add them from here as well. You can put quantity four and add there. And click that. So if you wanted to add a bunch of different uh, randoms into the cart, you could just go through and you know click all that and click each add three add two add and then you can add as many as you want there all at once. And this one was out of stock, and you'll see here that it was out of stock. But when you see two teams here, you'll get two teams in a break for 350. It always say how many teams you'll get in the title. See two teams, two teams, and uh, one team there. National Treasures. Two letters. This is a letter break where we use the actual letters of the players' names to determine who picks it up. Because there's no teams for USA football. But uh, anyways, let's go back to randoms. There we go. We also have our fantasy leagues. Like I said, they are all um, filled up right now, and you'll see the price payouts and all that good stuff inside the leagues. Over here you'll see supplies. We have uh, one touches, loaders, all that good stuff. You get mini top loaders. You'll see that the card in there is one of the mini autos from Bowman that kind of shows you what fits into the loader. Pack of 10, three bucks. Booklet top loader. You see how we have the booklet there shows you what fits. Uh, we got the Ultra Pro booklets. These are the uh, one touch booklet holders which are the same as that you got 20 points fits your standard base card auto and uh, we got sleeves thick sleeves for uh, patch cards team bags then we have all the sizes of loaders you need the 7 mm's they fit those huge court cards that's the biggest loader on the market we have the three fives they fit uh, thick cards you'll see an example of the card that fits. You see a base auto there. You see a jersey, thin jersey cards from Prime, 1.5s, 5Ms of thick auto patches from Finest, and then 2.5s, your standard jersey card there. So that's all our loaders. All right, let's see here. We also have we went over, we have went over the rewards program. I don't think free three box break, 5% back on all your orders. You'll earn a reward points. Let me go ahead and go to reward points here. Let's go to my account. We're going to go over my, your account here. Right here is where you can uh, review your orders from the past. I haven't ordered anything. This is a dummy account here, of course. But uh, you can go over all your different uh, orders. You can print invoices if you want to keep up with your teams. You can change your shipping address, billing address, password. You can add your credit, debit card, all that good stuff. So you don't have to type that in every time. You can also go to my rewards. I went ahead and put some points on here to demonstrate uh, the rewards points, how they work. Um, every 100 points is $1. I actually thought I updated this, but it looks like it's not updated, so I have to fix that. But every uh, 100 points equals $1. Once you get 1,500 points, you can cash that in. So I have 2,500 reward points. Let me go ahead and cash those in. And you'll see I turned 2,500 points into $25. And that will automatically update at checkout. So let's go ahead. Let's go to my account, my cart. Let's see. I only have $25, so let me take some of these out. All right. 
down here you'll see that you can check out with PayPal which is the most popular option and you can also proceed to check out so let's go ahead and click that since we do not have since we do not have a uh, since we have points to use so we're gonna use this we're not gonna pay so here we go put in your address right here here's something that's cool if you go to your account I'm going to go to shipping address. Um, on the order history for some reason. Hmm. Maybe because I don't have one on yet. Manage your billing address manager. Okay. Here we go. So what I'm going to do, you have your regular shipping address in there. And I know your name from your billing address. Right here, when you add a new shipping address, you can actually create a username for the website. So let's say I want my name, my username to be Hawks Cards. So I'm gonna go Hawks Cards. I'm gonna put in my address. add this address here so that is added in and let's go back to our cart here and check this out when we go to checkout there's our billing address this is the main address so you want this to be perfect but let's say that we want to use our username we can click that go to our new address that we just made is this one first name last name Hawks cards so that's your username one you got your address in there make sure that's correct and uh, everything's straight no payment because we have the reward points gift certificate there four dollars 28 cent place order and there we go we can go here and you'll see you got the absolute Cardinals you can print that so that you can see uh, you know if you want to keep if you have like 15 teams and you want to list sit there with your teams you can print that out that's a uh, always a nice option but you can always go to your accounts and review your orders you can go here you'll see pick a team Cardinals that's another way you can keep up with it also one thing to make sure you always get an email when you check out and doesn't look like I got an email yet. It may take a couple minutes, but um, we'll we'll check that out here in a minute. But uh, so we got our team, we're all set, everything is uh ready to go, and let's go ahead and look out how to find your teams or your breaks. Uh, we can go back here to events. There's so many different ways to get to it. You can view past breaks. You can go to events. I'll show you how both are the same here. You can click events. This will show you right now I'm live here doing tutorials. But uh, you can see all the past events. Same thing with a view past. But anyways, let's say that we're looking for pick a team that we bought on the 22nd. We'll click here. And you'll see how if you just go down, it's kind of a pain. You got to look at each individual one trying to find it. The best way to scan through the videos is to click post. So click post, and it's going to set them up like this. So you can scan really fast. Let's say we're looking for gold. There it is, gold standard. Click play, and we're good to go. New stuff they got in. Watch our video from the other night. Here we go. And there it is. Very cool. All right, so we're all done there. Showed you guys how to find the videos. Randoms are a little more difficult to find because um, they don't go every night. Let's say that we're looking. Here, let's go back over here. I'm gonna give you guys an example. 
let's say that we were not live on the 21st. So we were busy, weren't able to see what was broke. And USA 4, uh, box break 4, actually, let's see. Um, okay, USA 4 was broke here on the 21st. It's now the 23rd. I have no idea if it broke. Well, I know it broke, but I don't know what day it is. So instead of going and looking through every single event, looking for it, we can go up here. And we can type in USA 4. And we can click this and find videos. This actually looks over the entire live stream website, but it's actually and why is it not working? Hmm. Bad example. I was able to find them the other day this way. It's not showing me. There we go. <laughs> USA 4. You'll see these other ones aren't breaks. So you'll be able to click that and it takes you right to USA 4. So it's pretty pretty simple. If you just if you don't know what day a random broke, you can type in the name of the break and the number. That'll get you there usually. Like SP30, let's see, SP630. Let's see if we can find that. Let's just say it's SP30. Let's see if that pops up. If we don't know what I called it. Yep, there it is. See, if you know just part of the name and the box number you can find it. So there it is. SP630 and you found your break. That makes it pretty easy. You can get a, it's like a shortcut to finding the break there. Alright so we went over how to find your break. <clears throat> also for pick a packs, um, didn't go over that. Pick a packs will always go on the same night and I make videos for almost all the pick a packs. Um, if I know you're live with me watching the packs I don't make the videos. But um, let's say you know you do your pick a packs. You don't know where they're at. You uh, bought some packs. You know early in the day. You're not going to be live with us at night. I'll definitely make a video for you so you can go to that night and you can see Rodney, Jesse, Ed, Anthony, Alex, Butch. I cut those out for last night. And all, everybody who was live with us, I didn't cut the videos. But um, if for some reason you don't have a video for your name, you can always message me or you can go in the pick a pack video and uh, use it like a DVR and um, find your pack. Let's see here, we'll go ahead and start it up. It can be pretty tough. I've actually had to do it before to find, but you can see you can, you can skip through here. I don't see any packs yet. Let's go deeper in here. Websites. There we go. Hopefully next year we can get Jesse packs. You can kind of go through a little bit. Dawkins, see what kind of packs are getting opened. But that's kind of a tough way to do it. But if you ever need to find um, your packs, you can usually just let me know if I forgot to cut them. I usually have a time written down for the packs. But uh, that's how you find your breaks. Let's go ahead and close some of these tabs out. All right, let's see. We went over the news, all that good stuff. Um, let's see. Showed you how to make a username. Let me see if I can find a. Let's see. I'm going to take all the points out. I'm going to show you guys how to check out with another way. All right. So let's say that we don't have any points. Actually, I need to take points off of me. Let me take the points off the account. Uh, how about this? Random to add. All right, here we go. We don't have enough points to cover this. You see right here, mix and match. We got a three or more mix and match, 10% off now. So you see your discount there. All right. So let's say that we we have a balance of 21 here. We can either go through ch uh, checkout with PayPal, uh, just like eBay pretty much, and just go through there. 
But um, if we don't want to use PayPal, we can proceed to checkout. Go ahead and put your billing address in there. Uh, like we were showing earlier, we want to have our username, so it's Hawks Cards. Go down, you can use a credit card. And here you can use MasterCard, Visa, American Express, Discover. And uh, you can use a credit card here to check out. And you can keep it on file. All uh, credit card payments are secure. Uh, we use our, our PayPal processor, or our credit card processor is actually PayPal. So uh, it's all secure here. So you can use that uh, way to check out. Or you can also go to PayPal. So what you would do with PayPal... Item total is invalid. So let me recalculate. PayPal error. <laughs> That's funny, I'm getting an error during the tutorial. PayPal error, item total is invalid. Did somebody buy the Falcon? No. Hmm. Uh, that's very weird. Anyways, it normally works there. I've never seen or heard anybody talk about this error. I'm not sure why I'd have it. Anyways, that's kind of a bummer. But um, when you do click PayPal, it will take you to PayPal. You'll sign in, and then it'll bring you back to the site. I'm not sure if that has something to do with me tinkering around and going uh, to the other part of the site. But uh, you'll see your cards here on the edge. I'm not sure if you guys, I know some guys were asking me about this. It is uh, there for you when you add the cart. But um, I think that goes over, that covers everything. Um, you'll see this right here. We have, uh, you can also do trade-ins on the site. Any cards that you pull on the site, you can trade in with us. And we'll give you site credit right here. Let's see, trade-in program. So anything you pull that you want to trade in, just let me know, and uh, we'll give you a thing. We'll give you a reward points. And right here, if you're looking for singles, uh, we have some really good deals on uh, lots of hits. Um, all the hits that are traded in, we list in our eBay singles, eBay store. So we'll go ahead and go through to there. Here's our card store. Let's go ahead and click on a category here for eBay. You'll see we have over 9,000 football. 1500 basketball, 1000 baseball, a couple hockey here, and other. But um, you can go through our eBay store. If you combine these cards with uh, your website shipment, we'll give you free shipping. So if you want, you know, you want to pick up this Gates and you want to make an offer of a dollar for the Gates card, we'll accept it and uh, you can get a Gates for a dollar free shipping. So you can get some really good deals in our eBay store if you combine with your weekly shipment. We have tons of cards if you want, you know, if you're just interested in Cowboys cards, you can type Cowboys in our search, and there you go. We always put Cowboys in the title for your Cowboys cards for all the different teams, so it makes it easier to find your team. But that's our regular eBay store with our singles and all the trade-ins. Um, we also have eBay auctions. This is our auction account. You can go here, and all our auctions ended last night. We're going to get some fresh ones up tonight. So you don't see any in here, but we usually have a bunch of auctions rolling. And also, our Check Out My Cards store. We have a good amount of cards in here. We have about 10,000 cards on here. Lots of good deals um, through here. We have lots of autographs and stuff for a dollar, two dollars on our comm store. So you can go through here, just let us know. Uh, send us a PM if you're making an offer on a card. So, um, you know, we'll give you better deals when you're a website member. You can go here and uh, make offers on cards and stuff. But um, all the shipping for Check Out My Cards will be through them. They actually have all these cards in their possession. So um, you'll have to use them for shipping. But you can combine cards. I think it's $0.25 cent per card. And it's already added into the cost. So it's pretty cool. All right, that's our single shops. And I think I went over everything your account. You can contact us, your cart. And uh, that wraps it up for the tutorial. That shows you how to get around, find your breaks, 
If you have any more questions, uh, just let me know. All right, have a good one, everybody.